have a problem for you concerning series. What comes next? If I say to you A, B, C, you know that the next thing is D. What if I say 2, 4, 6, what comes next? 8. That's easy also. Here's a problem with a series that concerns not numbers, nor letters of the alphabet, but little pictures. There's picture number 1, picture number 2, picture number 3. Each of them consists of a circle divided up into quarters or quadrants. In the first one, those two quadrants are coloured. In the second one, the two quadrants on the left are coloured. And in the third one, just one quadrant is coloured, this one here. What will be the fourth one in the series? Figure it out. Well, I think this is one of the most difficult problems I've ever given to you. I wonder if you had it correct. Let's imagine that um, we have those quadrants coloured, a blue one and a yellow one. Think of them as hands of a clock rotating at different speeds. If the yellow one goes one space and the blue one goes one, two spaces, you can see that you'll end up with coloured quadrants in the position shown in figure number two. Now let's see if that rule applies, what we'll end up with in figure number three. Yellow goes one space and blue goes one, two. They're on top of each other, so yes, that's correct. That agrees with what we had in position number three. Now remembering that rule, yellow goes one and blue goes one, two spaces. The fourth one in the series should look like this, and it does. The bottom two quadrants coloured in. I wonder if you were correct. If you were, give yourself a good hard pat on the back. I want to know. Curiosity.